right, so we're here with Jack from Sega, and we've been checking out some of the digital titles that are on the show floor. Uh, first of all, this is Knights. Obviously, as you know, we're big into Sega Saturn, big into Sega Saturn Saturdays, and Knights is kind of one of the biggest titles on Sega Saturn. So what can, uh, what can you tell me about this version of Knights that's coming out? It's basically, we took the Saturn version and we made it bigger and better. It's all seven original levels are there. We up the graphics, made it widescreen, added a few things like achievements, leaderboards. There's a movie gallery where you can watch some of the you know, scenes about the story behind this. You can listen to all the soundtrack, so it's like the original, but better. Now, do you know this is based off the PlayStation 2 uh, Sega Ages version? that was released yeah, a couple years back in Japan. Yeah, it's a combination of the two. Just, I don't even usually reference the Sega, or the PlayStation version because a lot of Americans aren't really familiar with it. Well, we're all big Sega fans, yeah, yeah. so we know all about that stuff. Yeah, yeah. Now, can you uh, comment whether or not Christmas Nights is included on this? I, I can't comment on that. Nothing's been announced at this point. Darn it. Now, can you tell me if the A-Life system is still present in this version of the game? Yeah, so um, we pretty much took what was there and we kept it as is. So you, you can expect what you'd expect. All right, now as far as the other titles are going, uh, you have Jet Set Radio here. Yes. And you have, uh, I believe, Sonic Adventure 2 as well. Yep. Are those kind of like the same deal where it's just like a up res of the original titles or how, how are those done? We're actually doing this thing we're calling the Sega Heritage Collection. And it's kind of like a, a stamp of quality, if you want to call it that. Yeah. And all three of those titles are part of it. It means that we have up-res graphics, uh, bringing back the retro title, and we made it widescreen, but also we did uh, developer interviews with all of them. So kind of wondering, oh, how did this game come about? For this one, we have the developer talking about all the research they did into Dreams. Uh, same thing for Jet Set Radio and Sonic Adventure 2. Yeah, now Knights is kind of one of the hardest games to explain to someone who doesn't know. But it, it, in a weird sort of way, it's sort of what what dreams are made of in a way, but it's also kind of like something that's very pure gaming. Like, Nights is a kind of game, would you say, that couldn't be done in any other medium. Like, you could not make a movie or a TV show or anything else. Like, Nights is so entrenched in, in, game, in like raw gameplay that you couldn't do it any other way. Right, right, right. I, I think Nights can be whatever you want it to be. It can be an easy game if you just want to beat the levels, but at the same time, it can be a challenging game if you want to race through it and try to get the high scores. And, it just kind of fits best how, how it is, you know, it, you know the movies, whatever you're, whatever you're saying. I think it's, it's good how it is. Now, is uh, are the high scores posted online? Are there, like, leaderboards or anything yet? Yeah. So we got good. leaderboards, all that stuff, so if you're plugged in, yeah. XBLA or PSN, you can see all that, see how you're doing against the competition. Now, have you uh, considered using, putting the Sega Heritage titles, have you considered using, putting that on the uh, Nintendo Network at all for their upcoming Wii U? Yeah, so I'm not really involved in that decision process, so I really can't tell you. But right now, I know that these are being released on XBLA and PSN. Okay, now, my last question, and I have to ask it. Uh, since you are doing the Sega Heritage Collection, I want to know, where is my Skies of Arcadia? <laughs> you know, wouldn't we all like to know the answer to that one? Yes, and we all would. Uh, well, stay tuned. Uh, maybe we hear something, maybe you won't. Okay. Thanks for your time, though. You got it.